finally learn how to use Google when you're at a particular destination, you know, to, to try to find things and everything. Okay, you're, you're halfway there, okay, because there's actually even a better way. And uh, Tracy Repchuk is here today. She's a best-selling author, our technology expert today, talking about apps. And uh, why is an app better than Google? I mean, I, I go someplace to a, a strange town or even my own town and say, uh, cheapest gas on Google, and I get something. I get some answers. You're right. You can get about 100 answers that have nothing to do with what you're looking oh, for. Okay, well, that's, that is true. You it, do get a lot of answers. That's right, which is why an app is so great. It actually gives you, like, Superman powers, and it, and it can really help to engage and rediscover your area because everything's in one place. Okay, so l- let's just start then with, the, like, maybe the first app that you might recommend. Okay, this one's called San Diego 25. I love this. Top 25 area attractions. Preloaded. And they can really help you remember, you know, what are places you can go and see. All the descriptions are there, plus an easy-to-go-to map that instantly shows you how to get there. Okay, so, well, good. You got my attention immediately. So that's much better than just searching a general search and saying, yeah. show me the favorite best places in San Diego. Exactly. These are custom programs that are making it simple for you. Okay, so you like that one. Uh, give me another one we should have. Oh, okay, this one. Do you like to save money, Mark? Well, everybody likes to save money. <laughs> exactly. Okay, my favorite is called Gas Buddy. Okay, it brings up all the area gas stations with their prices. You can see the cheapest one, gets you the directions to go to it. Every single time you fill up, no matter where you are now, you're saving money. So now you can use this wherever you are. Exactly. At whatever part of town you happen to be in. Yep. And, you know, it might be a case of going, you know, we don't advocate, you know, driving 10 miles to save two cents a gallon. But right. if you're in a neighborhood, you can save three or four cents a gallon, maybe, mm-hmm. just by driving an extra block. You're good. Definitely adds up. You're good to go. Okay, um, something else everybody should have. Oh, yeah. Okay, so... What's a problem we all have, and that is parking, right? There's this app called Best Parking. It brings up all the parking areas where you are, and then the prices of those, so you can save money, you can find a cheaper location, and it tells you, like, if someone's full, so that you don't waste your time going to a place that's not available. Well, now, how would that work? How does that gather its information? Any idea? Well, actually, Gas Buddy gathers it from user information, so when anybody sees it, they're actually feeding the system. And in this case, it's, it's doing the same thing. It's connecting to that. So people just, they really like this app enough yes. that they, when they discover something, they just take a couple of seconds to update it. Exactly. And, and in the case of, the, of this one, it's actually search engine operated, so it's, it's auto-feeding the, the software product. Okay, so th- this might work downtown if you're going to the ball game, or yes. you're going out to dinner on a particular night. Exactly. In fact, it works all across the U.S. Okay, Let, uh, give me something to reduce stress levels. Anything. Uh, to reduce stress levels? Anything, yeah, anything. Okay, you're driving in traffic, Waze. It's called W-A-Z-E, all right? It's going to tell you alternate routes if you're sitting in traffic right now. Okay, and that, that one it might just say turn left? Up here? Or? Yeah, it'll say there's a traffic issue in ahead, so exit, go on this street, go on the next, and it'll route you around it. Uh, fantastic. Yeah. Now, um, give me some other idea of where I can go to get more information on apps and everything, because, again, I, I don't want to go to Google and search apps. <laughs> totally. <laughs> so where do I go? Okay, well, there's a couple places you can go. You can actually go to the App Store on your device, and you can put in a search engine up uh, there. Like, you can search San Diego. It'll bring up all the apps for that. I've also put together a free guide for everybody called 101 Absolutely Essential Apps, and your viewers can get that for free. Oh, where can we get that for free? AbsolutelyEssentialApps.com. AbsolutelyEssentialApps.com. Tracy, yes. thank you so much. It's been great, Mark. Good. Great to see you. Thanks for coming in.